Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Are you planning on visiting Tokyo anytime soon? And wondering if going to Tokyo Tower is worth it? Well, let me give you an idea of what's waiting for you. Personally, I came here because this was home to the One Piece anime amusement park. But I didn't thoroughly read the latest news about it and I showed up all excited and was shocked that it permanently closed. But since I'm already here, might as well see what the tower has to offer. For only $12, you can go up to the main deck, which consists of two floors. M2 is the highest point your $12 ticket can get you. Here, they have a VR bungee jumping experience you can get on. And the view of the whole city as far as you can see. <laughs> they also have a shrine up here. <laughs> M1 is the next floor down. <laughs> With the viewing glass floor, souvenir shop. Cafe and even a movie theater showing history of the tower. I'm 
This is very underwhelming. I was expecting a bit more. There's really not much here. Back at the bottom of the tower is more souvenir shops and cafeteria. And who would have thought there's a water park at the foot of the tower? Overall, it's like every other iconic city tower. Maybe my expectation was just too high, but I thought there would be more. So I was a bit disappointed. So if you're planning on visiting, come at night. At least you'll have a view of the sparkling tower and the vibrant look of Tokyo at night.